How do you feel? Uh, bit shit scared. Are you on the, the correct side of the road? Fuck. <laughs> no. We just picked up some Starbucks for our journey today. We are driving from San Jose to Napa Valley. Danny has the car. Mm -hmm. We're going via Golden Gate as well. We're going to try and yeah. drive across Golden Gate. How do you feel about driving here? I felt nervous to begin with. But you know, once I got going, I really got my stride and I settled into it's things. It's very different, oh. very different. Yes, and if you don't know, I know you, mm, some of your fans might be Americans as well, but if, if they're not, <laughs> don't say fans. some of your loyal viewers um, would my, maybe not know that in America you can turn right on a red light. Yeah, odd. I wouldn't want to be driving. It just feels wrong. It just doesn't. Why is it? Why is the light red? Why don't they have a filter exactly. light? Exactly. You know? So. That's what we're doing today. I'm excited to go to Napa. It's Danny's birthday tomorrow. Woo! 27! Think... No, he's not. <laughs> I think this vlog will probably be Napa and Lake Tahoe. But I'm not 100% sure. We'll mm. just have to see. We'll just have to see. I look a bit of a mess right now, but I have worn makeup every single day of this trip. So That's killer. I thought I would go fresh faced mm -hmm. for our road trip today. Hashtag Bobby. We're in a bit of an odd situation right now. We've arrived in Napa and we're in our hotel, like we got in, but there's no one here and we can't, apparently it's an online check-in. We can't check in, so we can't get into our room, but there's nobody here. Like we're phoning the number they gave us and there's reception, the phone's gone off, but there's nobody here. So like, what do we do? There's a tea maker here, so I've made myself a cup of tea and we're just gonna have to sit here and wait and I hope somebody comes. There's also another hotel across the road which is by the same people and we've been there and there's no one there either. I don't know what we do. We can't get into our room. And I feel disgusting, my hair is greasy. There's a toilet. Yeah, I don't, I'm not, the toilet's like an outdoor toilet. It's not all in the ground. There's only one car in the lot. This is weird. This is what the, lobby looks like though they've got the radio on it feels haunted i'm not gonna lie i hope this music doesn't get me copyrighted this creepy hotel i don't know what to do we got in i think our issue was that neither of us can receive texts right now because of like the sim thing we bought um but we got in 
the women who runs it is so nice yeah. and our room is amazing. This is our room and look, oh my goodness. And then you come outside, she also gave us a free bottle of wine and she said she's bringing like chocolates to our room. This is the fanciest place I've ever stayed in my whole life and outside. I'm not sure that I can do that. We've got a bathtub. <laughs> because well, you have to be so quiet though because yeah. that's where we were sitting we should use this, this is the bathroom also very very nice this is our hotel for the next two days for Danny's birthday so and then it's almost d6 Here's tonight's outfit. This dress I got from a charity shop and these heels, which I also got from a charity shop. What's your outfit? Classic Danny. Black foot cut jeans from L. <laughs> I think I'm tall man. I don't know, top shop. <laughs> no, the, the uh, urban outfits. Are they? Urban. Boots from ASOS. This is from Devon, it was a big. Wow, well, douchey. <laughs> This is our view to wake up to. I feel sick and hungover. Happy birthday! Thank you. Off for breakfast. Yep. We're off to the market this morning, so I just have this slip dress on. I finally got out my cowgirl boots. My hair's still a bit wet, but we're gonna come back and hopefully get ready afterwards because we're gonna do a wine tasting. From the farmer's market we just picked up some strawberries and also some of this apricot yogurt which we're gonna eat now. Danny's just running to get some spoon and then we're just gonna go on a drive up the valley before we go for our wine tour. getting ready right now for our wine tasting having a glass of the wine that they gave us here yesterday we just went to a market this morning and then took a drive up i'm really sure where but it was very nice just up the valley just up the valley just up the, just valley. Up the valley you know we're just valley girls and now we're going for winter like i've already said have you checked what wine it is they do nope. see the issue with going on a wine tour. I don't particularly like wine. I like white and rosé, like I can drink both of them, but red, I just don't like and I feel like it's mainly red here. But I will definitely get it down me because these wine tasting things are not cheap. I kind of want to try and curl my hair, but I only have the straightener and I just still... I still don't know how people call it hair with straighteners. I have a really nice dress to wear tonight. A House of CB one that Danny got me like three years ago when we were meant to be going to Nice. But we never ended up going because of COVID and I've been saving this dress. I actually wanted to wear it in Paris but it didn't fit me. But I think it fits all right now. I've been saving it for ages and I feel like this is the perfect time. Except I don't actually think the place we're going is super fancy but that's never stopped me before. Where is your favourite place that we've been so far, Danny? Um, Levi's Stadium. 
from the San Francisco Park Nairs. Okay, what's your favourite like area? Because uh, I think maybe Napa is mine. You liked the in Napa, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, I wanted to do the shops today. We can maybe do them tomorrow morning before we leave. Don't yeah. Really After our wine tour, we're just, I mean, you'll see it, but we're just going to come back here and have some snacks in the room for dinner because we went out for dinner last night. And we're going to count that as a 50 meal because it was so expensive. Napa is not cheap at all but it was still really nice and we had a couple cocktails afterwards at a different place is it better if i close the door okay i think that's better no it's not better okay the light is just not very flattering on my face so please just ignore that maybe i'm the problem we've only been here for like six days and we still have like almost two weeks left which is crazy like i really feel like we've been away for so long but we're having a really nice time i don't know what else to talk about here's my outfit can't really see because of the light but you look amazing thank you it's danny's outfit <laughs> wow, this was nice. It is really nice, isn't it? drink because our Uber driver gave us tons of recommendations so yeah. we're at this fancy hotel. I don't know if we'll get a burger, I mean the burger looks good. We're at somewhere with a rooftop bar so it's gonna be nice. I feel so bougie here, do you know what I'm saying? It's I such a fancy bougie. place. <laughs> Hold on, you need to move your camera a bit, don't you? Oh, wait. There you go. Ready? Yep. <laughs> Two, <one>. So organic. <laughs> We're currently in a very American bar. I am extremely overdressed. <laughs> But we're having dinner. So we went for cocktails before this. And now we're here having dinner. And then we'll stroll home. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. Happy birthday. Is that on camera? I need the loot. <laughs> Napa Hotel this morning and we just come to Target to get some washing stuff because we need to find a laundrette to put a wash on and then we're going to go shopping in Napa and then we're headed to Lake Tahoe which is fun also the lovely lady at the hotel gave us a free bottle of wine to take away with the us because we said it was done his birthday yesterday we stayed if you're in Napa by any chance I'm not sure if any mm. Any of my audience are <laughs> far away to you. But um <laughs> we stayed at the old ca old world Cabernet, then, Cabernet house. House in that. Very good. Washing is all done. Complete. And now it's time to go shopping. Can't 
said, this is too much money. in Lake Tahoe. As you've seen, it's really nice, very cozy. It's absolutely freezing here. According to my watch, it's eight degrees outside. So definitely very different than what we've had the past couple of days, but it's a nice change and it feels quite homey. But I wanted to quickly show you what I picked up in Napa, even though I didn't really get very much, but I thought I'd show you anyway. I picked up this t-shirt from Target because it was on sale just a plain grey t-shirt. I don't usually buy like plain t-shirts I feel like like basics which I feel like I need to do more. So I picked this up because it was on sale for only six dollars from 12 but It's strange here how when you go to the till you pay tax on top of it like at home We already the tax is already on the tag so this actually costs like seven dollars something, I'm not sure. And then the last thing I got was from Anthropology, which I know we have at home, but I really like this. Also, our washing isn't dry yet, so we've got the fire on, which we were gonna do anyway because it's so cold and we've like laid out all of our clothes there. I picked up this mug. It's like a pumpkin shape. My exposure on this camera so bad it's so bad it's so annoying i got this mug it's got some orange flowers on it it's shaped like a pumpkin very autumnal this was 16 dollars but as we've already established it was like 18 or something like that they had a lot of nice shops in napa they had some like more independent shops that i wanted to get some stuff from but i thought i should probably save my money for the rest of the trip. There was as well a top from Lululemon that I wanted, but it was $50. I think I showed it in the vlog, but I just thought, I it mean- It was really nice, wasn't it? I don't do sports enough to <laughs> be able to spend $50 it's on a sporty. top. But it was a lovely top. So we've got Lululemon at home as well, so maybe I'll buy it at some point. But yeah, we're in Lake Tahoe now. We probably won't go, well, we might go for like a drive or something like that tonight but it's already half six. Oh yeah. So we're just gonna have a nice chill night here and tomorrow we go to Yosemite. Yay. Which is gonna be fun. Oh. Not the rubbish. <laughs> Me trying to film a nice RT clip. <laughs> 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 